hockey is part of the fabric of the university. This program has a long story and rich tradition. There's a lot that goes into a UNH hockey game. You're going to kind of have to time it probably right as Max picks up. There's a lot of behind the scenes things that go on. Any questions? Before the game. My goal is for the guys to, to feel relaxed, to feel that all their preparation's been done. A lot of the guys get here pretty early, probably two and a half, three hours early before a game. A lot of guys take their sticks, listen to music, just kind of get in their own zone. Early on in the night, I like to listen to some country music, just kind of keep it pretty mellow and relaxed. And then as kind of the time goes through, you know, you listen to some faster paced songs. Or... Everyone's got a job to do. And then we have a team right. meeting an hour and a half before the game. We kind of discuss our plan and the stuff we've been working on from the practice and where we're going to implement the game. Hey, you got to get everything right now. After that team meeting, we go up for warm up and, you know, we get loose. And then a lot of the guys like to get together and play a game of two touch, soccer type game. I'd say it's always good to be a little loose before games. I tend to be a little looser. Once everyone gets in the locker room about an hour before the game to start getting dressed, um, it gets pretty serious. And it's just, just the music, kind of everyone's to themselves, doing their own little things. Everyone's a little different. Our F1 is always swinging with speed. You know, I talk to the assistants, what are some key points to being successful tonight or in this period? But we try to build those key points up throughout the course of the week leading into the game and then reinforce those before we uh, hit the ice. Angus, Patrick, Anthony, Benton, we'll be in the net. Let's go. Oh, yeah. Okay. Down in the tunnel before the games, just getting fired up, ready to go. A lot of guys have like different handshakes. I think I got a handshake with pretty much every guy on the team. There's something that you do or something that you say before you go on, and that's what makes being a teammate so great. It's, it's just a special bond. Having the ability uh, to coach here is uh, truly uh, a dream come true for me because I have such a great sense of the history and I understand the traditions and the values of this program. And for me, as a coach, that's one of the greatest traditions. It's passing on the history of our program to our current players. When we come in between periods, we'll look at video. Now that video, it may differ depending on what's happened in the period. Maybe it was a goal you gave up. Maybe you need to change the way you're trying to break the puck out or forecheck. There's all, that, that's always evolving. It doesn't matter if it's in the first two minutes or the last two minutes. Usually coach right. will come in and talk and try and fix some things that we need to work on, go over some things that we've been doing well throughout the game. And then guys will just kind of get refocused and ready to go for the next period. Love playing at the Whittemore Center. Definitely cool to see all the kids out there that support us. I remember being that kid looking up to older players and you know wishing one day I'd be in that spot and, and you know thankfully and luckily I had that opportunity to do that. The fans in general are just great out here. <laughs> Throwing the fish on the ice after the first goal is definitely one of the, the major things a lot of fans look for uh, when we score. Fish is definitely a very cool part of the game. I don't know many schools that do things like that. Having that come out is always, uh, it's always, it's always exciting, and you definitely want to be the guy who tries to get that fish out. Hockey East is the premier conference in college hockey, and on any given night, anyone can beat anybody. And our players understand that. There are no easy nights in our league. At the end of the day, the best part of playing hockey at UNH is the opportunity to play in front of our fans and our students. For a cycle across the middle and a shot to score. And I think that's what really separates our program from all the rest. Benton Mass with the game winner in overtime. Hold on, hold on, hold on, two, three, go ahead. And when we die, we're going to ask you to get so it's right on